Hello everyone, welcome to the next episode. In the last episode, we just did the parallel oh, oh battle. Uh, yawning. I forget what it I forget what it was called, but it was Sylvain's one. But anyway. Uh, let's quickly look at our certifications before we decide to go into the battle. I don't think anybody's ready for masters. I think the closest is you, but I don't feel comfortable with you just quite yet. Uh, let me see. You're 30, so I'm not even going to attempt it. Why am I still you? Gaspar, let's change you. Brawler. Oh yeah, nailed it. How far are you from? Yeah, we'll attempt you to be a sniper. And you failed. I knew you weren't up to it, Bernie. What about you? How far away are you from Warlock? I'll give you a try. Thanks to you, Professor. Yeah, and I think that'll be it for now. So let's head into the mission. Let's take part in the Battle of Eagle and Lion. The Battle of Eagle and Lion, a tradition, a traditional contest of strength between the three houses has arrived. It will take place at Grandeur Field, which lies in Imperial territory. So, this is to be our battlefield, Grander Field. Are you feeling confident, Professor? Very. Excellent. That's most reassuring. We can win. I'm sure of it. After all, it's not as though we've spent the last half year sitting idle. And I'm feeling stronger this moon. As though I could conquer a thousand opponents all on my own. That's reassuring. You can depend on me. I hope you know that. Well, it's about time for the battle to begin. Everyone, brace yourselves. <laughs> All I'm worried about is finding someone worthy to cross swords with. We've prepared and trained a great deal. We should be fine, right? You're always so carefree, Mercy. Don't forget we need to try our hardest out there so we can win. This is our chance to show how hard we've been working. Let's do our best. If I emerge victorious in the lauded battle of the eagle and lion, the ladies are sure to take notice. I'll have to go into hiding. Ugh, is that all you think about? Yeah, actually, so long as you try your hardest, frame it however you like. <laughs> I shall give it my all. No matter the battle, I will never falter. We're counting on your guidance, Professor. Let's show the world what the Blue Lions are made of! Oh, I was expecting the cutscene! <laughs> I forgot that we do this before the cutscene. Um, uh, let me see. Let's take a look at everybody. 
Don't know why you're all the way down here to do, but... Alright, so... Hmm... Do I want to bring Lysithia into the battle? I keep looking on, on Rafa Lawrence. Ignatz is low in the levels. Also, just to show, you cannot um you cannot use anybody from the church, including Citral. I gotta understand not using the faculty, like um Citral and Catherine. Don't know why um uh Samir and Catherine. I just don't know why Citral isn't available, because he's technically not faculty. But yeah. You cannot use them. Though you can use Anna. Let's switch you out. Yuri will bring you in. Yuri, what are your supports? I could give you Dorothy or Happy. Um, right. That's it. it. Oh, I forgot to check Constance to see if she was ready for a class change. God damn it. Well, I'm gonna have to remember to do that in the next episode. Uh, I think I'll give you happy. Let me see, um, does anybody else need supports to be worked on? Besides me? You're done, you're currently done, you don't need any. I think most people have their supports done so far, so... Oh, you need support since I can't give you adjacents. Because most of my adjacents can't fly. Um, alright, so we'll... I'll give you somebody... I'll give me somebody... So, uh, let's level. This case will be Ignatz. And Dimitri. Ba, ba. We're gonna have flame for this. All right. Uh, equipment. My sword's good. Um, I'll move that magic staff. And I think I'll buy you a spare silver lance. You need a new silver lance. Thanks a bunch. Is that the one? Thanks a bunch. you. I think I'll just outright buy you a new lance. Your silver axe is good. You need a new bow. Thanks a bunch. Is that the one? Thanks a bunch. Your sword is good for the time being. Is that the one? Thanks a bunch. Is that the one? Thanks a bunch. Is that the one? Thanks a bunch. Oh, uh, yeah. I'll have you have that goddess ring for a little bit. A bunch. Is that the one? Thanks a bunch. All right. Let's finish all battalions. Come back. Actually, what is your current? First off, let's. 
Give Annette the magic staff. Silver. Uh, yeah, I'll have you keep the. Well, I'm not gonna have you keep both a javelin and short spear. So we can store that. Unless let me double check. Are you high enough to use Empire Knights of Saros Kingdom? You're not high enough to use your own knights yet, are you? Doesn't look like it. All right. Unless I went past them and didn't notice. Let's start the battle. The battle of the eagle and lion is set to begin at long last. Everyone, show off the results of your dedicated training. Remember, we're not just fighting for honor. There's a prize at stake. It's almost time to begin. Steal yourselves, everyone. You all should know. I am not about to go easy on you today. As long as we can pull off the win, doesn't matter how. Our victory must be absolute, no matter what it may take. It is time. Forward, now! For honor! You'll earn a reward if you defeat more enemies than the other classes. Hurry and defeat the enemies before the other classes start fighting each other. I'll cut through. I love this song. Stay focused. Well done. I'll give it my all. The fight continues. Got the first kill. Sure thing. What should I do? I'll go. Send them in this direction. Ready. Thanks. Here goes. Thank you. Here we go. Nice try. and blue lions are fighting. Maybe we can sneak right past them.
<laughs> Who's next? All right, our turn again. Threat eliminated. Slowly advance. You can go that way. Much appreciated. Let's see what the enemy does. to jump out there. Now we've got no choice. Capture the central hill. Not good enough. Another win. Our turn. Archer battle. I must steal myself. Uchiski. Is there a chest on this map? I forget if there is. Yes, there is. All the way down there. Ferdinand. Yeah, any student you didn't recruit up to this far will fight for their respective house. Caliber. Give her that key. You're too kind. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. 
each battle a chance to grow. Turn. Dimitri moved up. Send you towards Edelgard. Your mage back up. I don't know where she took damage. I sometimes don't understand like where like the one damage comes from. Spears, you're going to be attacked by range. And I could cast silence on her. And she guard it. <laughs> now the Black Eagles do their counter attack. There goes Hilbert! As soon as I saw that brawler heading for him, it's like, oh, yep, Hubert is gone. Because the brawler counters mages. As expected. him Really? Both time silence was guarded, really.
so helpful. And poor to do this. <laughs> Far behind. What's next? Nice, level 30. I like how this feels. Over already? Great chance for me to find out if the sword of the creator really is all it's cracked up to be. On that note, you'd better not surrender too quickly. No time like the present. I can't believe I made it this far. Never. <laughs> Don't forget who you're dealing with. Want to see what the sword of the creator is like? Let's show you. Sorry, but it's about time I make my exit. The rest of you, please finish the job. In this chest, which is a lance killer, nice. Deal with Petra. Yeah. Oh. <sighs> that worked out. So she's gonna be targeting Dimitri. Sis. Yeah. Unexpected. Stepper. Just give up. Okay, where did he take damage? I saw his health bar just suddenly take damage. Why did he take damage? So, it is time to cross blades. I never imagined such a day would come to pass. If the Empire and the Kingdom go to war, we'll be able to fight as much as we please. I am sorry, but that is not something to joke about. The thought of fighting you is troubling at best. In that case, I wonder when you'll be able to stomach facing me in battle. Do you need a few moments?
I kind of like that dialogue between Dimitri and Edogard. Give him, um, if you've seen my first uh, route, what happens between the two of them? Quite helpful. Before I attack Edelgard. For his highness. Ooh, a crit! Nice! Had to be done. Now we will attack. I'm sorry, but I must retreat. You should have no trouble winning. Don't give up. Have no trouble winning. The only person she has left is a white mage. I think he's screwed. <laughs> Old to start advancing. Have this white mage um, see his impending doom coming. You never had a chance. That is the end of this year's Battle of the Eagle and Lion. And the winners are... The Blue Lions! We won! And judging by our performance, I'm certain we have earned the prize as well. We defeat the most enemies in the other classes. Oh, Ash was our MVP! I'm surprised he was, because he barely took anybody out. Especially once I got him to the Balliste. I thought it would be Dimitri, to be honest. My thank you so much! Well done, your princeliness. I'm certainly not in any hurry to get on your bad side. I assumed you would attack us head on. I clearly need to rethink my opinion of you. Well done, Dimitri. You both deserve equal praise for a battle well fought. All three houses did extremely well. Don't you agree, Professor? <laughs> they were nothing. The Black Eagle House was very strong. Not strong enough, clearly. If there's ever a next time, know that I plan to wipe that smile from your face. In any case, I hope the day never comes when we have to put this experience to use. I wouldn't mind. I'll accept a challenge from either of you at any time. <laughs> I'm kidding, of course. That is nothing to joke about. The true battle of the eagle and lion is best left in the past. In fact, I wouldn't be surprised if they eventually change the name of this mock battle. I hope so. How admirable, Teach. On that note, I have a proposition. When we get back to Garrick Mach, let's have a grand feast to break down the walls between our respective houses. And by a grand feast, I mean a fairly regular feast in the dining hall. You really value that kind of thing, don't you? <sighs> well, I suppose no harm can come from it. Count me in. I have no objections either. And you, Professor? I'm looking forward to it. You look so happy. I love seeing you like this. I suppose that look on your face is just another boon from this glorious day. Perhaps the best one of all.
I had a wonderful time today, Professor. As usual, I was astonished by how much you ate in the name of celebration. Really, though, I must thank you again. Our victory in the Battle of the Eagle and Lion was thanks in no small part to you. We all did our part. Yes, that is true. But it was your instruction that allowed us to reach our full potential. I feel silly admitting this now. But when you first came to lead our class, you unnerved me. You never smiled and you never showed anger either. And yet, you didn't appear to be suppressing your emotions. They just weren't there. At first, I thought perhaps you just didn't care for us. But I soon concluded that wasn't the case at all. For the longest time, I just couldn't tell what you were thinking. It was though you had no humanity whatsoever. And now? You're different now. In the half year we've spent together, I've seen the glow of humanity in your eyes and in your actions countless times. I am truly grateful to have had the chance to spend this time with you, Professor. What are you two talking about? How dare you get chummy without us? That's enough, Sylvain. Oh, please. I would love to join you as well. I have so many things I wish to talk to you about, Professor. Oh, me too. I have so much to tell you. And I want to thank you too. Honestly, Professor? I was only able to achieve so much because you were with us. Ash is right. You're irreplaceable to us, Professor. Yes, that! Without you, the Blue Lions... Well, we wouldn't even be the Blue Lions at all. Except for the blue part. Because we'd be sad. I suppose there are worse things than fighting at your side. I have had the opportunity to experience much. Please allow me to offer you my gratitude once more, Professor. <laughs> as you can see, you have our trust as well as our admiration. I look forward to spending the rest of the year with you. As do I. Good. Then let's give it our all this year. Anyhow, it's getting late. We had better return to our quarters and get some rest. I can only call your deeds during the Battle of the Eagle and Lion quite versatile. Comparing against their performance at the mock Battle of the Great Tree Moon, the students have grown significantly. It is clear that this is a result of your guidance. In appreciation of your efforts and to show our high hopes for the future of your students, I award you with this. Please continue to instruct your students as a model teacher. So? You've made good use of all my power after all. I would have been upset if you had failed at such an easy task. It pains me to assign such a disturbing mission to you during such a blessed moment in time. However, next month your assignment will be to journey to Ramire Village to investigate an abnormal occurrence there. Ramire Village? If I recall, you've been there with your father many times. An unknowable occurrence? I have yet to ascertain the details, but it would seem the villagers have been acting strangely. I have already dispatched the knights to verify the authenticity of this information. They should be back shortly. I suggest you begin by finding out what they have discovered. I pray this is not a bad omen. May the goddess protect you all. We get a blessed lance. And I forgot to use some of the talismans. And with that, we'll end the episode here. So if you enjoyed this episode, do you like the videos? It helps tremendously. Subscribe if you haven't already. Leave a comment down below on your thoughts of this episode. And share the video so more people can discover my content and help the channel grow. And I'll see you all next time. Later.